So guys, what up? Um, I wish you a great evening. I just watched the various titles of Generation Iron 2 and it will be totally different, I can tell you that. Um, I want to say that the first two big bodybuilding documentaries, of course I'm speaking about Pumping Iron in 1977 and Generation Iron, the first one, Generation Iron, in 2013 or something around that, uh, this was all about the pro bodybuilders, the pro active athletes who were preparing for the Miss Olympia contest and their road to their contest and the contest itself, you know. So the, the whole documentaries back then, the whole movies, if you want to call them movies, was about that. Now, in Generation Iron 2, you can see a trailer where you see Big Rami. Okay, this is an active pro bodybuilder who is arguably will get maybe one day one uh, Miss Olympia. So you see Big Rami and the whole Kuwait crew because there is a lot of speculation, a lot of a lot of rumors, a lot of interest in the Oxygen team in Kuwait. You see a trailer of Kai Green who isn't even competing at the Olympia. Okay, at the Mr. Olympia right now. You see a trailer of Callum from Mogga, who will probably never compete at the Mr. Olympia, open class at least, okay? The class where it's about all about, you know, everything. The biggest class in bodybuilding, you know what I mean. And you see Rich Piana, who was never even a pro bodybuilder, okay? And could never get a pro bodybuilder with his physique. No hating, okay? No fucking hating. But you know what I mean. So, but of course, Rich Piana is one of the most famous uh, internet fitness and bodybuilding guys, okay? He's one of the famous ones. Maybe the most, I don't know. But what I want to tell you about that, you see that uh, the, the, the uh, importance and the highlight of the Mr. Olympia is completely gone, okay? Maybe not completely because we also have Big Rami in it and guys, but you see that the main focus, which always was the Mr. Olympia, is not there. You know, we don't have the main focus on the Mr. Olympia. In fact, in none of these trailers we see the Mr. Olympia title. We don't see the contest in Las Vegas. We don't see the fight for the contest. We don't see Phil Heath. So I think this shows the the bodybuilding phase which which most guys are familiar with because most guys they don't give a fuck about the Miss Olympia contest and they are they don't know anything about the athletes there so when you, most guys you know most people who watch bodybuilding and fitness on YouTube know more about and are more interested on these guys who I listed on who are in the trailers of the movie and who will be in the movie then they are interested in the Miss Olympia contest. So this will be a new style of Generation Iron. It will be completely different. It will be completely different because we we, we have to uh, focus is gone. The focus is not there at the contest. The focus is on the most interesting guys in the scenes, most followed guys in this in the scene, and it will be interesting. Okay, we will see it. Did you like the trailers? Are you interested? I'm interested. We will see how it will be. I hope it will be interesting and it will be really something new. And we'll see it will will it help to break it more into the mainstream, which I think is the goal. We will see. It has arguably good chances of by the way, I'm going twenty one years of age tomorrow, twenty seventh of January. Thank you for all the subscribers. I hope I will get many, many more. I live in Germany. Sometimes I don't know. And I'm like, you know, why I even do these videos in English. But then I see some of you commenting on my videos and it all makes sense. So I wish you all the best. Follow me on IG at DennisER96. Link is in the description. Bye.